Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys. Today I am so out of the lake, so that's why there's no face cam right now. Some of y'all were commenting that on the last video. But guys, I have got a pretty epic uh, replay to show you guys. So as you know, the whole point of this base right here is to protect my lovely little lady friend right here in the middle, Miss Dark Elixir. You know what I'm saying? I've got almost 30,000 of it right now. I need 60,000 to research my golems. Ugh. So I'm halfway there. I'm halfway there to getting that. We've got some peck arts trained up. A little strategy that I love playing. 50 archers and 6 pekkas. It's a lot of fun clearing out bones and whatnot. But we're going to go ahead and watch this defense replay, guys. I get attacked by Loonian from a Town Hall 9. Max Loons um, and a 11 Queen and a 10 King. All right, And our goal again, guys, is to protect our Dark Elixir. So here comes Mr. CG King from M Legend. Coming in hot with his loons, all right? Um, he does have, it looks like two, uh, two, he has two heal spells and one rage spell, which I don't know why he's rolling with that. You would think he would have two rage spells, but he's coming in, and my wizard towers are wrecking his loons right now. You can see his loons in there doing work on my air defenses, and they only take down one of the air defenses. So I've still got two up. Everything else that he has left is minions. So any kind of air stuff that he's going to try and do to get, if he tries to get his minions in there to the Dark Elixir, it's not going to work. Sorry, little guy, but it's not going to work. Um, he's got 27 minions left. He does have his clan castle, though, um, and he also has his king and his queen. Now, I do have a lot of gold and elixir available, but I'm trying to protect my almost 1,600 Dark Elixir. He can have all the gold that he wants to because I can't upgrade anything else with gold anymore. Um, so honestly, I should probably move my gold out and my elixir in a little bit to protect that some more so you can see he's dropped down his king and his queen down here at the bottom um, my level 10 king is down there he's maxed out for my level uh, <laughs> and this guy's a down all nine and my king's the same but watch this he is going to uh, his queen is going to do some work to our king but we're going to take his king down to about half health that tesla is there doing some work but it is about to go down his king's almost at about a quarter health and then he is going to sadly pass away uh, from this earth but there goes the 48 percent there goes the 50 percent two star i don't really care again he's coming in after my gold i don't care if he gets my gold i'm just trying to protect my dark elixir which hasn't been touched yet all the loot that he's gotten so far guys has been from um the mines or from the the elixir the dark elixir drill right there um i think we had one over here that got taken out as well so his king's up in here. His king's about to go down. Wizard Tower obviously isn't going to do that much focus damage to one thing. So that's why the queen right here is able to very easily take out that gold without the wizard tower really doing too much damage um, to her. So this wizard tower is doing good damage. Uh, he does drop that heal spell though and then cloaks the queen. So, you know, wizard tower is going to go down super, super quick right there. Finally taking out the air defense and then heading over here to this other gold. But our Tesla is not going to have it. And then... Um, the queen's going to slowly work her way over. So we do have that one cannon that's getting taken out by that measly little minion. Get the freak out of here. But this Tesla's going to end up doing a lot of work for us. Ends up saving us 83,000 gold. Again, I don't care. All I need gold for right now is searching. Um, but obviously I need to save it up to max out to Town Hall 9 eventually. So we'll see what happens there. But guys, look at that. First of all, look at that percentage. You guys can make jokes all you want to. But all that he got was 12 Dark Elixir from us. And he had max loons, 28 max loons. Um, did he only use a heal spell? He didn't, he didn't even use his rage spells. <laughs> if he'd used his rage spell, I mean, he only had one rage spell. He might he might have been able to do a little bit better. But remember, he only got down one of our uh, air defenses with his loon so i'm pretty proud of that defense right there if you guys have tried the base out let me know how it works down below guys that would be awesome um to see what you guys think about that but we're gonna go ahead and uh go on a little bit of an adventure here and see if we can find ourselves a base with a good amount of dark elixir for our peck arch to go in and completely annihilate all right so i'll be back with you guys in just a couple seconds hold on tight for me while you're waiting why don't you go ahead and hit that like button for me and i'll see you guys in just a couple seconds all right all right, guys. So here we go. As you can see, not a much. Uh, there's not that much regular loot, but again, that's not really what I'm looking for right now. Um, can I pick this off for free? Nice. I can't. Can I pick this off for free? Nope. We're gonna try anyways. Though. And then we're gonna spread out some more of our archers right here. We're gonna drop off one Pekka right there in the middle to start working her way in. Um, again, we gotta try and take out this gold storage as best as possible. We're gonna drop off our other Pekkas. They're gonna go ahead, head on towards the middle. 
Again, we need to take out this. No. <laughs> yes, no. That's why I was trying to take that gold mine out. Look at that. Epic fail right there, guys. That is exactly what you don't want to happen. I rushed with the P.E.K.K.A.S. And it screwed us up. But I do think we should still be fine because now they're getting... Nope. Head in. Head in towards the cannon. All right. So here we go. We got one P.E.K.K.A. in here. Uh, we've got a couple P.E.K.K.A.S. in there, actually. We're going to go ahead and drop our King off. He's going to head up in there as well. And then head right in towards that Dark Elixir, which is exactly what we wanted. So actually, no fail. No fail whatsoever. Hello, Dark Elixir. Come into my Dark Elixir storage. So we're taking out all that Dark Elixir right there. What is going on in here? Are there like mines or something? Okay, there we go. So we got all the Dark Elixir practically. These P.E.K.K.A.S. are still working their way around the outside of the base our king is in the middle um let's go ahead i'm not even sure what's going on but we're gonna go ahead and throw a rage down in the middle get our pekkas uh going that are in there so we've got one more pekka that's almost down in the middle we've got two pekkas running around the outside we've got our king who is uh being stared down by the other king. <laughs> here he comes what is he doing did you all see that he was aggroed for a second and then not we're gonna go ahead and use his ability get the king rolling now he's gonna come up and watch this their king is going to 100 percent end up killing my king watch this watch this i'm about to call this i'm about to call this oh <laughs> so very close and all that was really attacking my king was that mortar um but we do have these pekkas working their way around 63 percent no real uh trophies available or anything like that there is 45 dark elixir right in there but i'm not really too worried about that because we did get the majority of it which is exactly what, 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 what <laughs> which is exactly what we wanted and now we've got over 30,000 dark elixir so thank you very much and like we saw in that replay earlier, our base is doing a mighty fine job of defending it. So I've got no problem signing off and allowing my base to uh, sit by itself for a little bit. 914 Dark Elixir, not too bad for a lowly little Town Hall 8 like me. But that is going to be it, guys. I'm going to train up another Peck Arch. We are getting ready for a war. As you can see, it's going to be in five hours. I'm number 21 uh, in the clan right now, and I'm going to be attacking, I believe, number 25 was who I voted on. Um... So we're going to go down here, attack uh, this guy. We're probably going to use Lunian, I do believe. Um, and let's see where we're going to attack from. Honestly, I'll probably attack from right here by this cannon um, and see if we can get up in there to those loons. And then down here by this uh, on this bottom portion, even though um, it does look like that air defense is super close to the edge, just like this one. So if we do attack from the top corner, we might be able to get in a little bit farther. So... We'll do a little bit of research on it and see how we do. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope that you all enjoyed. If you didn't, make sure you hit that like button for me. I really appreciate that. And as always, guys, make sure you keep calm and you clash home from me, right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.